Firehouse fans around the world are mourning the loss of the group's frontman, CJ Snare, who died at just the age of 64. The band confirmed this news in a statement. It was learned that he had been battling cancer, though he died unexpectedly due to what is said to be cardiac arrest. This is the statement from the band. This is the statement the band released yesterday paying tribute to their beloved frontman. They wrote, today is a sad day for rock and roll. It is with great sorrow we are letting the world know that we have lost our brother CJ Snare, the rock and roll warrior, lead vocalist, and a founding member of Firehouse. CJ Snare passed unexpectedly at home Friday night, April 5th, 2024. He was a young 64 years old. As you're all aware, CJ was expected to be back on stage with the band this summer after recovering from surgery. We are all in complete shock with CJ's untimely passing. CJ was arguably one of the best vocal talents of a generation, touring the world with Firehouse nonstop for the past 34 years. Our heartfelt condolences go out to the entire Snare family, Catherine Little, friends, and all our beloved fans around the world. Reach for the sky, CJ. You will forever be missed by family, friends, fans, and your bandmates. You're singing with the angels now. Firehouse released their first album in 1991. They had a lot of commercial success, winning over fans around the world. Some of their biggest hits include songs like Don't Treat Me Bad and Love of a Lifetime. Those were both top 20 singles for the group. The band's second album, Hold Your Fire, included the songs When I Look Into Your Eyes, another top 10 song for the band. And the band had continuously toured for many years. Now the reaction from his peers in the music community are pouring in with many of his fellow artists paying tribute to the late frontman. This one here from former Motley Crue vocalist John Karabi, who wrote, just heard that my buddy CJ Snare passed this weekend. Way too young, my friend, but I hope you're happy and singing with all of the angels. The band Winger released the following statement. We are terribly sad about the passing of CJ Snare. We shared the stage so many times and loved him so much. He was always a shining light of optimism. The world was a better place with CJ in it. He will be sorely missed. Rest in peace, CJ. Jack Blades, lead singer of Night Ranger and Damn Yankee, shared the following, just heartsick with the news of our rock and roll brother, CJ Snare's passing. Many wonderful memories of Night Ranger and Firehouse playing together. CJ's sweet soul and great smile always brightened up the day, no matter what was happening. Blessing CJ and sing it loud in the stars, my brother. Tesla shared the following, we are so sad to hear the passing of CJ Snare. We toured all across America with Firehouse in 1991. On our headline tour with the Psychotic Supper album, we shared many great times with them. CJ was a very kind man and a great singer. He will be missed. Jeff Scott Soto said the following, I'm so sad to my friend and fellow singer CJ Snare has passed today. I knew he was dealing with some things as I missed him on the most recent Monsters Cruise where Firehouse performed with the sub singer. Love and hugs to his friends, band, and family. Eddie Trunk shared the following, shocked to hear of the passing of CJ Snare of Firehouse. CJ was a friend, a great singer, and always a super nice guy. Condolences to the band, his family, friends, and fans. Brent Michaels of Poison shared the following, my deepest condolences go out to the family, friends, fans of Firehouse. CJ was a great guy, great vocalist, and a friend who will forever be missed. The band Warrant shared, we are saddened to hear of CJ Snare's passing. He was not just a talent and friend, but also a loved, appreciated, and brilliant part of our collective touring past. Deepest condolences and sympathy for his loved ones, family, band, and fans. Rest in power in rock and roll heaven. He was an outstanding front man. He had an amazing voice, and you could tell how many lives he touched by all of those tributes pouring in, plus many more. We're sending our thoughts and prayers out to his family, friends, and fans during this very difficult time.